RNA, which is a blueprint of DNA, is one of the most important segments of our bodies, able to indirectly control our metabolism by creating various proteins or by uh, influencing the traits we express, like curly hair or green eyes. One of the most important modifications of RNA is N6-methyladenosine, or M6A, that influences RNA's stability, transfer from one cell to another, and in the end the ability to create a protein. However, even though this modification is very vital, it is also very harmful, as a mistake can happen in placing this tag on the RNA, or a mistake can happen in the proteins reading it. M6A is closely connected to cells of acute myeloid leukemia, which is a type of blood cancer. This cancer occurs in the bone marrow and affects cells that would turn to be white blood cells. Therefore, acute myeloid leukemia results in an accumulation of underdeveloped non-specialized cells and a lack of white blood cells. However, when the cells of this cancer are analyzed, there is an increased amount of an enzyme called methyltransferase that transfers the uh, M6A modification on RNA. And when the methyltransferase enzymes are blocked in the leukemia cells, they shift back to normal cells. This is why we decided to try and find a range of blockers or inhibitors of methyltransferase enzymes for the usage of various computational tools. The main procedure in which this was done is called docking. For the inhibitors to bind to the enzyme, they must target a specific protein site. Also, the interaction between the protein site and the inhibitor or the blocker should be optimal. For this to happen, the inhibitors should be of appropriate size, orientation, and content to achieve good bonding and to block the methyltransferase enzymes from working. To ensure this, we also aimed to find molecules that had uh, content similar to already known effective inhibitors or blockers of methyltransferase enzymes. Acute myeloid leukemia, even though not as common, it makes up 1% of all the cancers in the world, is still a very rapid and very harmful disease and needs new and alternative treatment opportunities as soon as possible. If the research we have done proves effective and if the inhibitors are effective um, in, in real life, if these inhibitors can block successfully the methyltransferase enzymes, then we are one step closer to solving this cancer subtype completely. This research also shows how computational tools can be very useful in biological research and can be quick and effective and why they should be used more.